Hello, this video will focus on how to make a website powered by WordPress platform. My name is Oksana Preda and I'm a copywriter at templatemaster.com. WordPress started in 2003 with a single bit of code. Since then, it has grown to the largest self-hosted blogging tool in the world. CMS is used by millions of sites all over the globe and seen by tens of millions of people every day. But let's come back to the topic of this tutorial – how to create a website with WordPress. Today, savvy entrepreneurs use WordPress themes to create a website rather than design everything from scratch. This is the simplest, the quickest and the most cost-efficient way to make a website. So I advise you to use WordPress templates for the purpose. There are plenty of free and paid options available for immediate download. You can see some of the beautiful examples now. Fashionia – online fashion magazine responsive WordPress theme. Dalton – modern hotel and resort WordPress theme. The Legal Way – lawyer and attorney WordPress theme. Emanuela – dance school responsive WordPress theme. I hope you like the WordPress themes featured above. Are you ready to continue? Ok, first start on WordPress.com as opposed to trying to learn the process of setting up databases and customizing PHP files. You will eventually want to learn the basics of this as they will be very helpful, but for now let's focus on getting you up and running. Use the free subdomain on WordPress to begin with. Considering it may take time to migrate your content, you will probably want your current website live. Pick a theme, any theme you like. You can even use one of the free WordPress themes. Whatever. Focus on content and what you want to be able to do. Learn the differences between pages and posts. Posts aren't reserved for just blogging, but they are certainly more suitable for that. If your current site is a handful of different pages going over your business, use pages. On the other hand, if you have a collection of articles, consider posts for that. Here comes the tedious part. Unless you're using another blog and template service, you will need to copy and paste your current HTML into whatever you choose, whether that be pages or the posts. If you have 10 pages on your current site, great, you'll be done in an hour. If you have 1000 pages on your current site, well, there are ways of importing, but you'd have to write a script for pulling for, for your page and write it to the database. That's dangerous if you don't know what you're doing. Getting back to it, even if your current HTML formatting is OK on your current site, you'd better go in and copy just the content and the reformat in WordPress. You can do this with their What you see is what you get editor or the text editor when you can manually put in HTML tags. Know that your content and your template are separate. Unless you require the use of something like advanced custom fields, you can easily and freely move between most WordPress templates. You can find some great ones at templatemaster.com. Once you've chosen a nice template, checked out some plugins and moved your content over, you can point your domain at WordPress.com using the guidelines on domain mapping. Then we recommend you to get another server and install WordPress yourself, which you can get at WordPress.org. Understanding what is going on is not necessary, but if you're interested in continually developing your website, it would be very helpful. So these were eight simple steps telling you how to make a website having a variety of quality WordPress themes at hand. As you see, everything is pretty simple. 